Welcome back to another episode of NA Now. I'm Brandon Hofstra, joined here by Dan Barry, junior hat trick head coach, Matt Voidy. Matt, first off, welcome down to Dallas, Texas. Thank Thanks you. for joining us. Uh, and congratulations on the new role. Obviously, last two seasons you were the assistant coach with Dan Barry. Talk about how great of an opportunity it is now to be the bench boss over there. Um, I think it's a great opportunity to, you know, maybe reimagine some things. Um, you know, I think your first two years in the league and we started in COVID, mm -hmm. um, which was a big challenge. And we weren't really able to implement some things that I think under normal circumstances we would. Um, you know, last year we kind of came out of, obviously we came out of COVID. Um, it was almost like a year one again in some ways. Right. Um, and we had to sort through a lot of um, issues and things that you know weren't even hockey related that we just weren't able to sort through the first year. So I think this year, you know, we can really go forward. And there's no COVID. There's no issues we haven't dealt with that um, you know need to be dealt with. And, and we can just go forward and really implement you know a, a strong hockey culture. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, some new situations there you becoming the head coach. Um, let's talk about where you kind of picked up going into the NA draft and you guys had the first pick in the 2022 draft. Yeah, we took, um, we took Jacob Lavallee, who's a, a big center from, from Canada. Had, a, I think, a couple games in the queue, um, so he could be very exciting um, when he gets down. We, you know, we, we needed some to address some needs up the middle you know we had a couple guys go to the ushl which is great but at the same time it it, it leads it leaves um holes that we we need to fill right uh let's talk about um what you're expecting for this upcoming season i expect us to take a, take some big steps in terms of our culture and how we do things on a day-to-day -day basis that's going to be the main focus for us um really having pride in you know when we come to the rink every day and protecting our culture mm -hmm and how we do things and you know obviously there'll be x's and o's and, and and whatnot but that has to come first and once we get that then the x's and o's get a little bit easier yeah and is there any veterans from last year that you're looking on to lean on for leadership yeah we have a core group um coming back mostly forwards you know uh andrew eberling robert hyde miles harrington pete lajoy um you know we have some younger returners like lucas sukovic Jake Howard that, you know, are really going to be big for us. Um, Adam Johnson and that, all three of our goalies played a considerable amount for us last year. So I have high expectations on all three of them, to be perfectly honest. So, you know, and I've had those conversations with them, and they're, they've embraced and they're ready to go. And a showcase is just around the corner. Are you ready to get things going? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're chomping at the bit. <laughs> right on. Well, good luck this upcoming season, and we're looking forward to what you're going to bring out there. Appreciate Thanks. your time. Thank you.